Hey guys, so I have been doing Dollash for like three, four weeks, um, less than four weeks, I think. And I am going to talk about my experience in Indiana. Um, I'm very, 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 very south side, um, like really small town in where cheap as people live in there really cheapest anyways um, from my experience it's not worth doing it as a David driver because um, what I get from Dodders you know how much I'm getting from Dodders only 225 so two twenty five dollars plus tips. That's what I get. Uh, no matter how far from there. I mean, from the house, uh, from the store to uh, store restaurant or whatever to the place. So sometimes I get like twelve miles. For two twenty five to like four dollars and something like that. I'm not gonna take that. Most people gonna decline that kind of offer because we get less pay. Um, so that's really not paying for it. Like they don't really think. And today I got really upset that something makes me wanna stop. Um, I drove almost fifty miles. 50-50 miles today um, I mean last night it's already past midnight so um, and um, why get it's like $42 I, I can't even make a dollar per mile it's not really worth it um, Usually it should be two dollars a pair, uh, two dollars pair mile, uh, because I have to think about uh, the store to the house, house to where I was. So um, yeah, it for for driver it's gonna be two trips, you know, for some back. Anyways, um, so I did work from 5 p.m. I had one hour off and then I did it till like 1 a.m. Close to 1 a.m. And I only get $42 and I drove like 50 miles. So it's not really worth it to be honest. Um, it's really disappointed where I'm living because, like I said, we're cheap as is people, cheap as is living. Uh, it's a hell because they don't want to tip or tip is really low. Um, I took decent offers, but I don't get much, um, unfortunately. And <coughs> Kind of like, uh, what can I say? Um, I got highest I got is like eight dollar something today. I mean, last night. Um, that was like eight miles away, eight eight point something miles away, and opposite from my house. So, um, and. You know, gas is expensive. Um, yeah, sometimes I have to go all the way up, upstairs, and they tip me only like a dollar, two dollars, three dollars, something like that. Um, the funny thing happened today was a lady who had who also does DoorDash driver. Um, she tipped me. She tipped me only a dollar fifty, because she knows how it is like. So I go like, why? 
it wasn't that far from her house to the store. Um, but I, she was drinking outside smoking, so I guess that's why she took the Dwadesh. Anyways, um, what I got from doing her grocery was like five dollars something. Um, I had to go back to the car, my car, and then grab two two gallons of water as well. Um, two bottles of one gallon. Um, so total is two gallon. Yeah, ice cream uh, and other heavy stuff. Uh, gladly, she was not living in apartment. Uh, if it was like apartment that goes up uh, without elevator, that would be hell. Um, so, um, if you're using Dwadesh, you will have to think about uh, driver because we use our own car. Uh, we use gas. We use mileage. And we use our own time. Okay, so um, if you don't tip much, driver might not take it because base pay is low. Like I said, I only get 225 in my area uh, unless there's peak. There's, when there's peak, um, I will get like a dollar to three dollars. I never got peak time um, offers because I cannot get into the schedule usually. Um, I can only do it when they are busy. Uh, that's when I can do without scheduling. <clears throat> but, man, I got like a large bag of insulated um, bag for like putting pizza and like, large stuff to keep food warm or cold um, but I feel like it's useless because I don't get enough paid um, as long as I don't get paid enough I cannot keep this job I can't um, like I said I drove only 50 miles and what I got is like $42 it doesn't even add up you know what I mean it's crazy one day just one day draw draw like 50 miles think think few weeks uh, since I started the job um, it's crazy amount my car my brand new brand new car just adding up miles and I don't get enough so it's not really <laughs> worth it you know what I mean um, and if you do driver uh, you better pick a um, good car like uh, you know less less gas because mine is Traverse uh, it drain gas so much it's not worth doing with the truck and stuff you know where where it took so much gas. Um, actually, um, it, gasoline is really high right now. It's really pricey, expensive. It's really ridiculous. So, I've been feeling gas a lot since I started Dash. But it's, I can't make it, I cannot even make $100 a day. And I'm bringing two kids with me because I cannot afford for daycare because I'm not qualified or anything. Middle class pain. 
it's a struggle. Middle class struggle is real. Um, <clears throat> and also, um, it's funny thing. Um, I had a peak day on 11.30 p.m. to 1.30 and I was so stupid enough to take enough to take an offer uh, at 11.24 so six minutes before peak time and I I thought it was gonna be a quick pick up and drop off so I, that's that's why I took it but and I ended up waiting like 30 minutes to get the dang food and while I was waiting I talked to the uh, customer service because I didn't want to I didn't want to wait too long you know what I mean at 11 30 I started worry about hey it's peak time two dollars fifty cents more and if I didn't get it if I just gonna unsign and take new order that gives me peak time and I talk about it and they say um, if I'm eligible I will get it and I explain everything to them like um, I accepted the order a few minutes before and then I've been waiting and it seems like food is not ready yet I was talking to them like 25 minutes or something and they're like hey give, send me proof of the peak time you know um, if you qualify you should get it blah blah blah, blah. so sounded like sounded like they're gonna fix that for me or give it to me but ended up I didn't get it and I talk about it and then they're like oh because you didn't get, you didn't accept in on on time so I was like that's what I'm talking about that, that, that that's what I was talking about you know what I mean I accepted the offer offer few minutes before and I have been waiting for the food they are not ready so if if I'm not gonna get peak time peak pay I, I wanna unsign it I don't want to take that offer because I can just take out the offer for 220 250 more and they're like oh we must be misunderstood like no you're not misunderstood and <sighs> so stressful they're purposely doing it so the order don't get cancelled and they don't have to pay 250 more even though they don't pay pay us enough that really makes me upset like <sighs> I get so many stupid offers like hey you wanna drive 10 miles for two dollars 25 hell no hey do you wanna drive nine miles for four dollars no something like that it keeps popping up in my area like that it's ridiculous um i laughed when i got offered um 12 miles for 225 because customers don't tip and then um the daughters don't want to pay more than 225 of course i decline it but it's it's not really worth it. I, I was really excited to work as food delivery because um, I got two kids that I cannot take them to daycare because I cannot afford for them. I mean, afford for it. And I wanted help paying off medical bills. I have like 16k medical bills that needs to pay off 
because government want to charge ridiculous amount of medical bills on me. Uh, anyways, um, <clears throat> that price is after insurance. It's crazy. Um, but ended up losing money. Um, I got like. Eighty dollars last week. I mean, this week I literally just got it for last week. That's seven days for eighty something dollars. I wanted to cry, like that's that's right. Regular people's a day work could be even less. <laughs> DoorDash is really. Funny about it, like, uh, but some areas、uh, they pay a lot. Like I have seen, like, Dutch people getting like、uh, five dollars to twenty five dollars as a base pay plus tips. So it's really depending on location, but in my area, only two twenty five as a base pay. So. I also have seen like food stain, like ice shake, shakes from、uh, steak and shake. I declined that offer because it it didn't give me enough.、Uh, I think it was like four dollars offer for maybe six seven miles or something. That's for only one way, so. It's like fourteen miles in total for a driver. I only get four dollars. Who's gonna do that? You know what I mean. And anyways,、um, it was sitting at the restaurant for at least thirty thirty minutes. I pick up other order. The decent order, like it was like seven dollars something. <coughs> For like five miles, and it was on the way home. So I was like, "Oh, it's fine."、Uh, so at the moment, when I pick up all different order, the declined order from thirty minutes ago was still sitting there.、Um, it was already made in. It shakes inside, so I was like, "Oh, that shake must be co- not cold by now." You know what I mean? <sighs> so that's what happens when customers don't tip because we don't get tip enough. So we can't just do it. I I I cannot do it anymore.、Um, I have to quit doing food delivery. Um, unless they pay me enough, um, yeah. Like I said, I'm just wasting my my age time. So five, five from five, six, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Um, almost seven hours. And. Forty-two dollars. What I get? <laughs> so I worked seven hours. Why go is forty-two dollars? It's not really worth it. Like bringing two kids. One is still a baby, and one is a toddler. I I'm so ex- exhausted right now.、Um, I'm really tired today.、Um, My eyes are really hurt、um, for driving that much hours, and I didn't even get paid enough.、Um, so yeah, I think I'm gonna quit. But I'm really sad about it because that's the only job I could do it with with the kids.、Um, so. But my husband already told me, told me, 
from the beginning i'm not gonna make much i'm just losing money so to stop it but i wanted to try it because people getting good money like i have seen people receiving like over one thousand dollars in just a week just a week yeah so they get to pay a lot a lot of money so i was like oh food delivery might be good but not in my case because of the location sucks um and even this is a small town there's too many dashes here so yeah it's like that so i i can't keep working like this um that's my review like how i felt doing dash for a few weeks um but if if your area is good i would recommend to get uh, a large insulated bag put on the uh, passenger seat and drink insulated drink uh drink bag for the foot area where it's more suitable um that way you can keep customers drink cold or hot and um cold food or warm food for um longer and yeah something like that i just i'm sorry i'm really tired like my brain is not working right now um oh shit it's almost 22 minutes oh, i spoke too much so anyways i'm i gotta go i'm gonna relax um all right guys have a good night <laughs>